Rica is one of the tiny countries of Central America where one of our principal exportations is bananas. We export and import from the port city of Limon. Although the bananas bring us most of our wealth, the wealth as a result of the bananas does not reach this coastal area. Limon and the Atlantic coast cities are one of the poorest areas of Costa Rica. On April 22 of 1991, a severe earthquake measuring 7.4 on the Richter scale hit Costa Rica. The earthquake affected mostly the city of Limon and all of the Atlantic coast. This earthquake was felt in all of the country, leaving thousands without lights, water, or telephone. It was a terrifying sensation. Two deaths were registered and hundreds injured. Over 15,000 people were left homeless. The homeless sought refuge in the soccer fields. They used plastic, cardboard, and any other material to protect them from the rains which had already begun. The destruction was vast. Over 75 miles of highway and seven bridges were destroyed. What took years to build, the violent shaking of 35 seconds caused incredible damage. As one looks at the crevices made in the highways and the fallen bridges, one cannot help but stand in awe as to the mighty force of nature, leaving what man has made to disappear in a matter of seconds. The railroad looked like twisted macaroni. The ecological damage was also very great. Mountain ranges, which were once covered with tropical jungle, now appear as if someone has stripped their skirts from them. A picture of total deforestation but in this case, due to the earthquake. losses have been estimated at $60 million. This includes the highways, bridges, water pipelines, sewer lines, homes, and many others.
Assistance has been given in the evacuation of the injured as food, water, clothes, and other important articles are flown in. All of the aid had to be done with small airplanes or helicopters because of the severely damaged highways and bridges. Alliance and the Baptist churches, along with hundreds of others, have made their presence felt in Limon. The Alliance has worked through a network of pastors who have been responsible for the distribution of food, water, and clothes. We have been responsible for the health aspect of the area affected, the planning and making thousands of family health kits with Clorox for the purification of water has been one of our major jobs. Preventive brochures on how to stay healthy under these conditions has been very important. The most difficult part of the tragedy now becomes very evident as the families begin to rebuild the homes they have lost. The reconstruction of over 3,000 homes totally destroyed and over 1,000 damaged is the great challenge now. your help at this time. <laughs>